Hi guys, so today I'm back with a new video and this is my June favorites video. I know I'm kind of late on this one, but hey, better late than never, right? But yes, like I said, this is going to be my June favorites video and I am going to be talking about what I've been loving this month. I think I only have four or five items for makeup and everything else is like random stuff. So yeah, and if you see me like looking on my phone, like, you know, looking at it you know it's because I wrote them down on the notes section so I don't forget anything and yeah I guess let's just hop into it so for the month of June I've recently been wearing a lot of eyeshadows probably because I want to kind of expand on like my makeup look and I just want to learn and you know try out new things so for this month I recently discovered my old trusty Victoria's Secret palette and this is from like two years ago I guess I wasn't into like eyeshadows that much until this month so yeah so basically it just has different gold shades and one dark silver shade so aside from the eyeshadow thing or eye makeup thing that's been going on with me I've recently been into the whole eyebrow game strong on fleek thing going on so I recently picked this elf eyebrow kit and this was only three dollars I believe there's like a gel and powder part on this kit and I've been completely using the gel and I'm actually wearing it right now it I mean I think they're kind of on fleek right now I try to keep them on fleek every two weeks I get them done every two weeks I get them threaded because I don't know how to pluck my eyebrows and I don't want to shave them either so I get them threaded but yes I've been using this kit and it is amazing guys it is amazing for three dollars go get it so the next makeup favorite I have this month is this NYC smooth skin bronzer and this is in the shade sunny and I might have had talked about this last month I don't know but I'm pretty sure I've talked about it before but basically it's just this bronzer from NYC and it's a matte bronze, bronzer, bronzer, browser, what? Mario Kart, what? But basically it's just this matte bronzer and I'm wearing it right now. It looks natural on my skin. I mean, you can also build it up and if you want like a really harsh, noticeable contour. I really like this because it's matte. I tend to be oily during the day, so highly recommend this because it's a drugstore product and it works well, so. So for this month, like I've told you guys, I've been really into wearing eyeshadows or like eye makeup. So what I've been using to put eyeshadows on my eyes are these two. And this is the Coastal Sense BRCNO2. I don't know if like that's a number. I'm not sure. I'm just barely starting you guys. But yes, this is an eyeshadow brush that I just use on my lid. And then this one is the e.l.f. Flawless Concealer Brush. And basically I use this on my crease. Did you hear? The motorcycle. And I know it says concealer brush, but I use it on my crease. And it works perfectly fine. And these two have been a lifesaver. I know they're not like super fancy brushes, but I mean, they work well. I ain't complaining. So for this month, I've also been loving this Neutrogena Oil Free Makeup Remover. This has been really helpful on helping me to remove all the dirty stuff on my face. And yeah, recommend it. Drugstore product. Go for it. So last but not least on my makeup favorites of this month, I have this Garnier Fructis Sleek and Shine Anti-Freeze Serum. And I use this when I curl my hair, when I straighten my hair, or when I'm just wearing my natural curly hair. And I like this because it keeps my hair shiny. Two, it does the job of preventing my hair from frizziness. And three, it just makes my hair smell fruity and I like it my hair is smelling fruity. I don't know, do you guys like your hair smelling fruity? Because I do. So this is like an A+, try it out. It's a drugstore product and yeah. So for this month, this has been my best friend. My best friend has been helping me to get my stuff together. Yes, I have like all my errands when I work, events that I need to go to, aka I have really no friends, you know, by events I mean like Netflix movies. And I also write things down like what I need to edit on like videos and stuff and then when I need to upload them. And yeah, just a different errands on different days. But yes, this has been keeping me on track and I have never been so thankful to have you, best friend. 
it makes me feel like a sophisticated busy person when really all I do every day is sleep, work out, eat, Netflix, sometimes go to work, and film videos. That's the truth, you guys. Alright guys, my next favorite is my ultimate favorite of this month. It's just these sunglasses. It's these super duper awesome sunglasses. That was only like five bucks. Look how awesome they are. I cannot stress enough how awesome these glasses are. So the next one is something a little bit crazy and probably made my mom a bit scared or like worried that I'm a very wild child. But it's just a septum and basically you just, I swear to god I'm not picking my nose. Basically it's just this fake septum thing that I picked up a like fashion queue for like three dollars. I don't know like it's just really fun to wear and my mom was like oh which tribe do you belong to? I was like okay mom. So yeah let me know if you guys like septum rings or not or this is weird. I don't know I just think it's really fun to wear and it's nice to try out something new every day. So my next favorite is actually hoop earrings. Yes hoop earrings. I'm actually wearing one right now. This one is from Forever 21 and it came with like another two sets of hoop earrings that are like kind of bigger but I think these are like the perfect size for my ears because they're not too big and they're not too small and they're just they're just so much fun you guys. I think this year I'm just gonna be trying out different new things you know because it's fun. They don't feel too heavy I mean they're like dangly and fun and yeah so I think they're really cute and so for the month of June, I was hooked into drinking tea. And for this month, I've been drinking this Lipton Green Tea 100% Natural. And if you guys look at it, it comes with like two packs and I already finished the one pack and I'm like halfway or like one third away from finishing my second pack. So on to clothing favorites, I've been really loving long flowy dresses and this is like a Brandy Melville flowy dresses. This is not from Brandy Melville if you guys are wondering. It's just the material is just like Brandy Melville like it's really soft. And this was featured in my June haul lookbook so if you guys haven't seen it you guys should watch it because it's pretty cool. So along with that I've also been really into buying the same style of clothes but in different colors. So I have this in red like I showed you guys. This one in red and then I also have one in black. And then I also have it in army green. The only difference with this one is this has like a cutout shape in the back and it's really cool. I haven't worn it. This is like an unhealthy obsession I can already tell because like every time I see something and they have it in different colors, I just ended up like buying it. So it's really unhealthy but <laughs> I don't know guys, I can't stop. Another clothing piece that I've been loving this month are t-shirt dresses and this is just a regular stripe, almost Brandy Melville look-alike t-shirt dress. And I've also been really into the whole stripe design thing on clothes, so yeah. So I've been on the hunt for good boyfriend jeans that fit me perfectly and I haven't found them until this month of June. And this is from Fashion Q. It's just this boyfriend jeans that are like light wash and very distressed and I really like the detailing because I don't exactly have any jeans that are like this, let alone I don't have any boyfriend jeans. So yeah, I went ahead and bought this and I've been wearing this I think almost once a week this month. So another random favorites of this month are my tripod and my studio lights that my boyfriend gave me. They have been such a lifesaver. I'm actually using my new tripod right now and my studio lights are packed up. I kind of don't want to take them off because it takes a long time but yes they have helped me so much this month when it comes to filming and I can't wait to use them more. So on to music favorites of this month. I've been loving, I have been loving and obsessing over Cheerleader by Omi or OMI. I'm not sure how you say his name. But yes, I've like listened to the original one and then I also like the radio edited one so I'll link down the original song and the radio edit on my description box. I've also been loving I Like The Way You Love Me by Michael Jackson. I think it's like an old song but I've just recently like, I just recently heard it from my brother and then I just got really hooked into it. I don't know what I did that but 
And last but not least, I've also been obsessed with Megan Trainer and John Legend's song, Like I'm Gonna Lose You. Oh my god, you guys. That song, the first time I heard it, I think... <sighs> it's such a nice song. Go listen to it. I'll put the links down. I'll put all the links down below, so... So I have two favorite shows this month. My first favorite TV show this month has been Flash. Oh my goodness, Barry Allen! Barry Allen! Yes, I've been watching Flash for this month. I've actually just recently caught up because I don't know if you guys know or watch Flash, but it's been out since like, what, months ago? And I was still in school when it was out, so I didn't really have time to like watch it. But I finally caught up this month, and yes, I'm up to date. I can't wait for season two. Oh my god, Barry Allen. Like I said, Barry Allen. You guys should definitely check out Flash because it's such a good show. So far, so good. 10 out of 10. Watch it. My favorite TV show of this month is also Pangako Sayo, and it's like a Filipino teleserie or TV show. And it has like my two favorite love team. Like in the Philippines, we have all these like couple love team that they like pair up. And yes, it has Catherine Bernardo and Daniel Padilla. And oh my god, they're OTP, guys. OTP. So I have three favorite websites this month, and they are Tumblr, BeautyCon, and Netflix. Those three are my most visited websites this month. Tumblr, because Tumblr is just funny and it can either make you cry at 3 in the morning or just make you laugh out loud. Beautycon, I am going to Beautycon and I've been like eyeing and contemplating about whether buying the ticket and I did buy it this month. I bought it with my own money and so yeah, that's why I've been on the Beautycon webpage for like every day. I'll be going to BeautyCon and I'm really excited. It's Saturday already and oh my god, I'm so excited. I've been on Netflix nonstop every single day after I come home from work. I'm just on Netflix watching movies all night long. So, so the real MVPs are the friends who let you use their Netflix account. Thank you, Jordan. You know who you are. Thank you for your Netflix account. I've seen Down To You, She's All That, Mean Girls. I've recently also been watching Gossip Girl series again for like the fifth time. It's just Netflix is life, you guys. Like Netflix is life. And that's all my favorites of this month. I hope you guys enjoy this video and I'll talk to you later. Bye. Guys, I'm so excited for me to go on. Like I printed out my ticket, the maps, everything I need. I just need to choose my outfit. Wherever you go, wherever you go.